Okay, part two of this repair job on this climate control display. Uh, cracked this thing apart, and it's just got four little small screws that hold it uh, hold it together, the casing of it together, like this. I used a nut driver and a three sixteenth socket on the end of it to take that out, and then when you get it apart, it'll be kind of looking like this. Anyway, what you do is this part that's on the front right here, you face this down so this doesn't all come apart on you. These little, it's got some loose parts right there. But you just carefully uh, lift this out and this part here now is going to be still attached over there. I'll show you what you do with that. But you lift, the, lift this off the front part where the screen is, just lift it out. And then this will be still connected here, sort of like, sort of like this. It'll be kind of fixed to that but what you gotta do is you gotta come back and on the this thing has got four bolts on it also that you remove and carefully work that out it's got pins right here on one end so you kind of got to be careful and don't damage those you're gonna just gonna easily push down and push this board out of the housing and so when you get it apart this is what you're looking at now before I've got this thing apart, I've already been tipped off where to look for problems. And I don't, I don't know if this camera is good enough to show you, but you see, see how far in we can get here. Probably not, but let's, come on, come on, come on, focus, 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 focus. It's really having problems with it. Okay, you see these five resistors right here? They got 241 on them. Uh, these are known to have cold solder joints on them, solder joints. Solder, whatever you want to call it, however you pronounce that. So that's where I immediately looked, and sure enough, uh, it's hard for you guys to see, but if you look, if I look closely at these, I can see that. Can you see those two right in the middle, right there? See how they've cracked apart? That's a cold solder joint. So, it looks like the third one's doing the same thing. See that there? So that's absolutely what you gotta look for. So that's probably the problem right there. So that's that's how you get into it. And I'm gonna go ahead, I'm not, I'm not the world's best uh, person at soldering, but I, I think I can get through that and repair it so uh, I'm gonna warm my iron up and uh, resolder these and we'll try it out but that's what, like I said it's real simple to take this apart you just got you, you got four little bolts that take the halves of the housing apart then you'll pull that board out of this front side leave the buttons down and then simply carefully unbolt this board from the back part of it and slide it apart. Just be careful with this when you're handling it, you know, it's pretty, pretty, uh, well, I don't know how well built it was even when it was new, so now, now for sure, be careful with it. So that's, that's what I'm going to do, guys, and I'll do this, and, uh, we'll put it back together and see if it works. Bye.